we want to first start off by saying our prayers go out to DMX's family. Our prayers are with DMX. But this is a valuable lesson. No matter how much money you make, no matter how much success you might have, no matter how many materialistic things you might have, no matter how many women you might have, um, you have to learn how to deal with your pain. You got to learn how to deal with your trauma, your hurt. You got to learn how to deal with your ups, your downs, your stress, your heartbreaks in life. Um, because those things money cannot fix. Um, and we see this with DMX. DMX is a legend in the hip hop community. Um, not only is he a legend, um, he's one hell of an actor. Um, a lot of times that is overlooked in his career, but DMX was a very good actor. Um, I love the movies that he played in, but we have to understand, man, in life, right? In life, people go through things and certain things have happened to people that they might not never bounce back from, right? And we see this with DMX. Um, a lot of people are confused on how a person of his caliber could OD on drugs, could be an alcoholic, right? Um, a lot of people think, broke people think money fixes everything, right? And that's not the case. Money can fix financial things, right? But money cannot fix your heartache and your pain. Money cannot fix the things that you have been through in life. So you got to start looking at stuff like this, man. It happened. It's done. It's over. Move on, right? Because if you cannot deal with it, right? If you cannot deal with your pain, your pain is going to deal with you. If you cannot deal with your heartbreak, your heartbreak is going to deal with you. And at the end of the day, um, it might be all over for DMX. Um, we're not wishing bad on him. We speak in reality. Um, they said that he OD'd, and when he OD'd, he had a heart attack. Right? And they are saying he has he is in a vegetable state. So we don't know if they are if he's on a breathing machine and they're trying to keep him alive. Uh, we don't know the full details. Um, but I will say this: deal with. Deal with what you got to deal with. Um, stop running from it. It is what it is, right? But you got to deal with it and you got to dead it right there. You, you got you to gotta kill it right there. Because if you go on in life and you and you constantly let your heartaches and your pains and your heartbreaks uh, continue to be a burden to you, continue to affect your mood, uh, making you negative all the time, uh, uh, continuing to uh, uh, not be around those, not respect those who you love because of because of everything you've been through. You you can't meet new people and treat them as if they are the the ones who did whatever it is that happened to you, right? So you got to be able to deal with it because if not, a lot of people are not gonna want to deal with you. And if you don't deal with it, like I said, I promise you, at the end it'll always deal with you. Uh, I don't know if you know DMX's story, but he, he's been through a lot. Uh, he's been in foster care. He's been homeless. Um, uh, um, dealing with his mom, uh, being on drugs. So, you know, people like that, man, like they have a, they have a lot of uh, mental issues, man. Um, I had a friend who, who OD'd, right? And we never knew that he was on drugs, but the whole time he, he was using heroin. And uh, he OD'd, man, and, uh, he, uh, he lost his life. It was a good dude. Um, but I want to say this, though. Uh, he kind of grew up like DMX, uh, homeless in foster care, uh, living with this family, living with that family, uh, not really having a healthy relationship with his mom, his dad. And uh, like I said, man, just it's just it's just a sad day in hip hop, man. But not only hip hop, man, I don't want to be selfish, man. It's a sad day for his family because uh, his family really need him and a lot of people. And I was one of the people who was rooting for DMX to come back strong, get healthy, get in shape, uh, start back doing music, start back doing uh, movies. Because I like I, I like DMX in movies more than I like this music, right? I like this music, but I like them more uh, in movies. I felt like that he could have had a big career uh, doing movies, man. So 
like I said, man, uh, as this story unfolds, we're going to come and give y'all updates. But like I said, y'all keep DMX in y'all prayers and y'all keep his family in y'all prayers. But I want to leave y'all on this. Learn to deal with your heartbreak. Will your heartbreak deal with you? Peace.